Jester Tester, an honest review for you. Hello everyone, Jester Tester is back with another review. This time, we are reviewing the Love and Ice and Dice by Quaints. Now this striking French design tennis bracelet is incredibly adorned with Swarovski crystals, so let's have a look at it. Here it is, guys. First of all, if it comes in a gift box, the box is really, really nice. It has gold leafing all around it. It has the Quaints logo on it. It is a well-designed box, so it's great if you're going to give it as a gift. Uh, makes for a great presentation. Let's get right into the bracelet. This is the bracelet, and it is a striking piece, I have to tell you that. The Swartzky crystals on it is some of the finest crystals I've seen yet to date. The clarity of the crystals is incredible. You have to see this up close to believe it. Just very, very well done. I'll, I'll give you a closer look at the crystals in a second. But the way it's done, um, you can see the crystal, it's half and half. Each heart has a clear crystal and an ice blue crystal in it, which really makes a striking um, display on this tennis bracelet. I'll tell you what, they really have gotten incredible with the the jewelry now years ago this used to be considered like costume jewelry and when you've seen costume jewelry uh years ago it looked like it came out of a gumball machine it was really you know plastic crystals or plastic adornments or something like that but now the jewelry now that you can get for a uh, low price the the quality of it is just incredible like I said, the crystals are on this. If, you, if, if anybody's um, not used to Swartzky crystals or never heard of it, Swartzky is an Austrian uh, company that makes the finest uh, lead crystals. They actually have them in um, telescopes and binoculars, things like that. So they've been doing it for many, many, many years. The, the uh, crystals are some of the finest quality that you, you can buy. It's just really, really something else. The links on this is really nice. The thickness, the weight, just just a striking piece. We actually have it on somebody. They, they wore it. We'll put it up right here, and uh, we'll take a look on how it looks on the wrist. As you can see, it just, it, it just shimmers. And if you see this in sunlight, it is incredible. I mean, it shimmers in regular light in the in the review room lights here but out in sunlight you'd have to really see this to believe it it's 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 actually incredible now the uh length on this is seven inches now it has a two inch extender on it making the total length nine inches which is really nice it comes with um on the end there you'll see like a little heart design end there which is really nice let's put a um extend uh, a lens on here and uh, see if we can blow this up a little bit so you can see that you have to see the crystals on this look how well done these crystals are there we go the clarity look at the facets in that in that crystal alone look at that clear crystal look at the plating on this how perfectly done sometimes you see plating on on pieces of jewelry it's it has uh, like a, a rough texture to it or it, where you can see where the plating is missed in areas but not on this i'll even show you the back and you'll see how shiny that plating is how perfectly layered that plating is i mean you could tell when you look at really good electro plating you know when it's done well. Look at the shine on the back of this. Okay, now they usually don't um, have attention to detail on the back. They don't care what the back usually looks like of something. But you can see, if I can get it to stop shaking. You can see how clear, look at that, how clear that is. You can actually see the camera and the logo on the camera reflecting on the back of this that's how how shiny the plating is on this the finish it's 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 incredible so forget about the back i mean the front is just a striking piece look at that let's see if i can get that blue crystal in there let me see if i can move the light a little bit so you can see that it's just shaking so much i can't get it to let me see if i can there we go 
Is that crystal unbelievable? Just take a look at the facets in that. The clarity. Now, I've seen crystals other than Swartzky crystals. They're nice, but you can see a cloud in the crystal. Uh, believe it or not, I can see... Um, crystals are easy to easier to pick up uh, defects or, or um, inclusions or anything like that easier in a crystal than you actually can in a diamond. It's actually clearer to see it. Um, you, you, this you can see how perfect that is because you can see how clear. There's no yellow or lines stuck in there or or. It's just a just unbelievably well done crystal. And for the price point that this bracelet is sold at, I mean, you definitely can't go wrong with this. You really can't. And I mean, this, this can be worn formally uh, or informally. It'll go with almost any anything you want to wear it for. I mean, prom season is coming up now, Mother's Day. Any, this would be great for anything. Got your girlfriends, your wives, anybody who would... Man, I'm telling you, it's, it's just a great piece. Like I said, I'm really impressed with the, um, the plating on it. How shiny and how perfectly done that is, even on the edges. Like I said, when you blow up some other jewelry that's plated or anything like that, like I said, you can see the roughness in the texture on it. They don't really care that much. They just do a very quick plating. But you can see that the electroplating on this was done very, very well. Now, to clean this, any with any plated jewelry, you have to be careful with... Um, you definitely don't want to have this on and spray with perfume on top of it or anything like that because the alcohols um, can be corrosive to plating. It could just take the top plating off and then bring you down to the uh, surface metals. So you want to be careful with lotions or colognes or um, if you wash your hands with a strong detergents or anything, you definitely want to take this off. If you um, care for these kinds of plated uh, jewelry pieces, they'll last a really, really long time. Um, they recommend, the company recommends that you can actually clean the crystal with baby wipes. Um, that's the first time I've heard that. Um, but, uh, yeah, I, I could see that because there's nothing really caustic in baby wipes. So they say you could use, um, clean it with baby wipe and then wipe it with a dry, clean, soft, dry cloth to polish the crystals. And you'll get it right back to the shine and uh, you'll take off any kind of finger grease or any dirt like that. Um, so that's a great uh, little tip there. All right, so that's it, guys. That's the review. Jester Tester saying, be well, guys. Happy shopping. And until the next review, we will see you.